In this video, we take a look at the 5 best Anand receivers for 2022. Each receiver has its own unique features that make it a great choice for anyone looking to upgrade their home entertainment system. We hope you find this video helpful and that you decide to buy one of these receivers. In the description box, we have included links. Now let's get started. At number 1 is Denon AVR X3700H. In this review, we'll take a look at Denon's mid-range flagship AVR X3700H. It is capable of handling 9.2 configurations directly and 11.2 through external amplifiers at 105W at 8 ohm or 135W at 6 ohm. HDMI features are supported by the X3700H. The video bandwidth is 8K at 60Hz and 4K at 120Hz. Additionally, HDR10 Plus and Dynamic HDR are supported here. Competing models lack an essential feature, dubbed QMS, which allows the source to quickly change the resolution or frame rate to eliminate screen blanket. This 8K receiver can also upscale existing HD and 4K content to 8K, so more people can experience the full power of 8K. Including the hide virtualization feature, this model supports all modern audio files available with DTS and Dolby. As a result, it is possible to imitate the sound environment in the surroundings. Before a test, I calibrated the test system, as the calibration system completed its work in about a quarter of an hour. This new Denon played with its full power, capturing my attention with its solid sound quality. I was also surprised by the high performance of the audio compositions, Despite being mighty, the sound is crisp and clean. Each vocal part is excitable due to a combination of solid dynamic expressions. Power and clarity enabled me to dive deeper into the soundtrack and capture each instrumental part. In contrast, streaming services do not cope well with the receiver. During playback, I could clearly hear a stutter. Overall, the sound quality was poor low detail and lack of pronounced highs and lows. In stereo and surround modes, the Denon AVR X3700H produces incredible quality and crisp sound. Furthermore, the receiver displays the same excellent image in both native 8K and upscaled 8K. As a result of the review, I can confidently say that it is the best Denon receiver in general. At number 2 is Denon AVR X4700H. The Denon AVR X4 1700H is a mid-budget receiver that can satisfy even the most demanding music lovers. It has a killer sound and a feature set that makes it a great transitional receiver between Denon's top-end and mid-range receivers. With its HEMI video path, the AVR X4 1700H supports 8K 60HC and 4K 120HC with both pass-throughs, but only works on one input and upscaling to 8K. On all HEMI inputs, it supports Dolby Vision, HDR10+, and HECP 2.3, featuring 9 power amplifiers, 125W at 8 ohm or 165W at 6 ohm. The AVR X4700H delivers enhanced productivity with 11-channel processing and surround decoders such as Dolby and DTS-X. I would like to add to what has already been said. A max enhanced bass decoders are available. All audio decoders, including Dolby Surround, DTS Neural, X, and Oromatic, are included. As soon as I started testing the unit with a movie, I was surrounded by a high-definition sound stage and spatial effects. Each action on the screen was accompanied by appropriate sound. It didn't seem like I was watching a video at 60 HZ, but rather at a much lower frequency, somewhere around 30 HZ. Music scores are handled confidently by Denon, impulse fidelity, excellent course dynamics, and high spatial density provide a high perceptual ratio. From high to low frequencies, the 4700H can deliver detailed sound. If you have a wired multi-room system, this will also work well in a nearly 30 square meter listening room without compromising. Otherwise, you can use the EOS protocol to make a wireless multi-room system without burdening the device. Multi-channel enthusiasts will appreciate the Denon AVR X4700H h massive power, rich hardware, and full 8K compatibility. The AVR X4700H is the best Denon receiver under $2,500 to remember for a long time.
At number 3 is Denon AVR X6700H. Denon's top premium 8K unit is the AVR X6700H. There is an 11.2-channel amplifier module in the top-of-the-line AVR X6700H. The power is 140W-8 ohm or 175W-6 ohm per channel, and I think such a power would be enough to fill even a large room. In addition, if you still use two different sets of speakers, you can set up different settings for each. Compared to the previous Denon AVR X6500H, the X6700H has 8 HDMI inputs and 3 HDMI outputs, all of which are HDMI 2.1 compliant. Due to this, the AVR X6700H supports 8K-60 HD and 4K-120 HD, along with the latest video technologies Dolby Atmos, DTS-X, and even DTS-X Pro. Additionally, this device is compatible with the Max Enhanced up to 13 channels in 9.1, 2, and 9.14 configurations. As usual, I started the review by watching a movie. Switching from Blu-ray player to TV caused unpleasant picture jerks. Dynamic and detail were impeccable, and the sound was delightful, clean, and understandable. The bass, however, could have been a little stronger. Of course, the best Anon receiver cannot sound bad. Similar results were obtained with tracks. I had a realistic perception of the sound stage, and the output is accurate and detailed. Bass ranges were also slightly underestimated here, but the subwoofer made up for it. I was really surprised by the Denon X6700H. For a realistic surround sound experience, Dolby and DTS's latest decoders produce excellent detail, dynamics, and fidelity. With such high-quality sound accompanying an 8K image, this is an outstanding premium Denon AV receiver. At number 4 is Denon AVR X1600H. Denon's AVR X1600H is an affordable 7.2 receiver with surround sound. In addition to having all the essential features and connections, it offers enough power, 80W with 8 ohm impedance or 120W with 6 ohm to meet modern standards. Furthermore, a powerful amplifier unit provides a function that is not available to some budget receivers by imping. A vinyl player can also be used with the receiver. First, let's talk about video capabilities. On the back of the Denon AVR X1600H, there are five more HDMI ports, only six in total, and an ARC output. HDMI inputs support 4K 60HC, HDCP 2.2, HDR10, Dolby Vision, and HLG. With this set, I have not encountered any compatibility issues with UHD TV or Blu-ray players that already support higher resolutions than classic Full HD. Listening to Hi-Fi on the Denon AVR X1600H and streaming music work very well when it comes to music. When I increased the volume above average, distortion appeared and detail disappeared as before. The sound is crisp and clear but less loaded with low frequencies. Vocal parts sound distinct and strings sound very natural at high frequencies. All of this gave me the impression of being surrounded by a rich soundstage. I tuned the entire audio system using the auto calibration system to get excellent results. As expected, the sound was excellent and the movie soundtrack reproduction was crystal clear and very detailed. With good bass reproduction, the sound is expressive and agile. As a result of its exhaustive feature list, and fairly outstanding performance, the Denon AVR X1600A should be considered the best budget Denon AVR. You can use Dolby Vision or 4K with it, so purchasing such a great option makes sense and will delight you for years to come. At number 5 is Denon AVR S650H. Last but not least, I would like to tell you about the entry-level model the Denon AVR S650H. Although this is a very budget-friendly model, it has some interesting features as well, such as HEOS. There are 5 HDMI inputs and 1 HDMI output. They are all compatible with 4K HDR10, BT2020, wide color gamut, downsampling, and pure color. High image quality was achieved with this feature set. The Denon 4K receiver was designed to make the most uncomplicated budget home theater experience possible. Firstly, it's a 5.1 receiver with 75W-8 ohm or 100W-6 ohm power per channel and a dual output for a subwoofer. During testing, 
We found that all channels have high current control, which, along with the developed power, guarantees excellent control even of the most demanding loudspeakers. As a result of the complex menu, configuring the receiver before starting the test took quite a while. However, the Denon AVR S650H provided me with very good sound quality during the test. When watching a movie, the AVR S650H creates a beautiful atmosphere with sound movement behind objects, as well as accurate and realistic side effects. The model works well with Dolby and DTS decoding. Using autocorrection, however, will provide you with the best around sound. However, the stereo sound isn't very good. At half the volume scale, I noticed some artifacts and too much emphasis on the midrange. For listening to music, I prefer to use the multi-channel mode, lowering the surround speaker level. For an entry-level receiver, the AVR S650H exhibits excellent power and dynamics, although it reproduces music rather mediocrely. A home theater can fully exploit its sound potential. That's it for today's video. I hope you enjoyed this video, and please like it if you did. If you're new here, click the subscribe button. Wishing you all the best until the next video.